Well, hello everyone. Welcome to Concerts from Quarantine. This is an initiative we set up as soon as the current situation kind of escalated to the point where we had no concerts anymore and we felt like people were going to be missing some live music. Um, we miss playing for people as much as we miss playing with each other. It's a really important part of my life and I was desperate to, to do something to keep it going. So we're here in my music room in Battersea and we're going to play some lovely music for cello and piano for you. Um, all my adult life I've been blown away by the power of classical music at unifying and expressing our common purpose and common cause. I've known Luba for over oh, 10 years nice. now and I've had some of the happiest moments of my life when making music with her and so this feels really special to be bringing you some of our favourite pieces this afternoon. Um, yes, thanks everyone for joining us. Um, I'm Luba Lubyshevna and I'm a member of the Royal Opera House and um, or Royal Opera House Orchestra and uh, well, there's a temporary closure, unfortunately, at the moment at Royal Opera House. I'm just very happy to be here with JP and to be able to bring you this uh, uh, small selection of our favourite pieces and to wish you all a very happy Mother's Day from everyone at the Royal Opera House. Cool. So the first piece we're going to play to you, we could think of no better, given the beautiful weather outside the back there. London is just kicking off with spring right now. So we're going to play you a really fresh, uh, crisp number by Frank Bridge called Spring Song. Okay, so we're now going to play you a couple of pieces that have a little bit more connection to today. Um, although this has all been kind of thrown together in quite short notice, we did want to do something today and not have our first one next week because it's Mother's Day today. And speaking purely personally, it feels very strange to not be able to see my mum and give her a big hug on Mother's Day, even though she only lives 10 minutes away. So, yeah. So it would be nice to play another couple of pieces by Frank Bridge. 
but with a little bit more of a Mother's Day theme. So the first one is called Berceurs, which is basically a lullaby, and the second one is called Cradle Song. Yeah, it's actually my mum's fa two favourite pieces, and mm. well, I can't, my mum doesn't lift them in the way I'm afraid, she lives quite far uh, in Moscow, so that's um, my way to say Happy Mother's Day to my mum, so hope you enjoy this. Thank you. 
Okay, so we're going to depart from English music uh, for our last piece today and going to move to Germany, um, in many ways the birthplace of so much of our classical music heritage and tradition. Um, this is a little bit of a shamelessly personal uh, choice. Uh, not only is it Mother's Day today, but it's also my mother's birthday, um, and Brahms has always been her favourite composer. So that was an easy choice. And then an even easier choice, really, was to choose the second movement of the Brahms F major cello sonata, because it is just simply one of the most beautiful things I've ever heard in my life. So, Mum, this is for you. I love you and wish you a very happy birthday.
can't say that. <laughs> I'll get me through a week. Uh, <laughs> thank you everyone for joining us. Um, I don't know if I'm happy or sad about the fact that this will be the first of many. I guess I'm both. Well, we uh, hope it'll be first of many and we hope you'll join us again next week. Everything go, yeah, everything goes well. Hopefully we'll be here with you again next week and uh, we hope to do uh, probably half an hour programs of uh, various movements and pieces and please let us know in your comments uh, if you have any requests or even if you have any questions about what life of musicians is like or what's it like working in the Royal Opera House so please do let us know yeah we'll be knocking up the program <laughs> on the spot a few days in advance so nothing is off limits I think well we'll try to do it as varied as we can with uh, maybe introducing one less known work every week but largely, have a nice time and hope you can join us. Thank yes. you so much for today. It's been a pleasure. Thank you very much. And hope to see you next week.